All right, today we're going to be painting the catio inside and out. Um, we're also remodeling or landscaping the backyard and the front yard. Um, we got rid of a bunch of dirt and now we're putting down some mulch so we don't have weeds growing back in the backyard. So our main goal here today is to show you what we're doing with the, uh, the painting of the catio and putting mulch down and maybe even planting some uh, specific low tolerant plant material to get this backyard and the catio ready for finish. Why don't we go take a look in the back and show you what we're doing. Alright, so we got all our doors and windows masked off, as you can see. We're getting ready to uh, paint the stucco and the catio. It's all going to be in the same color. So we've got our whole floor all masked off, as you can see along with our paint can right over there ready to go and our airless sprayer we're going to get this all hooked up and start spraying and we'll just show you that technique once we get going Okay, so we got the paint done on the catio, as you can see. We got it all taken care of on the, the roof deck, all the roof rafters, even the house over here. It's all painted white. And now we're installing our catio screen mesh material. As you can see, it's down here. And I'm getting ready to, I just cut a piece here. And we cut them on an angle to the angle and the pitch of the the catio roof and as you can see we've already got several of them up already over here on the side we got it above the screen door we've got this piece hung and I'll show you what my crew is doing on the outside as we cut our lumber on angles to match the pitch of our roof we're actually painting them so we paint all six sides but here it is on the outside. So we stick the screen on, as you can see here, halfway on the post. And then when we're done, we stick a one by four with these holes in it and, with, and we're screwing it down. And as you can see how we're screwing it down up above. And what this will do is it'll make it all nice and tight and uh, we're not relying on staples to hold the screen on. We're relying on either our furring strips or our batten boards, whatever you want to call them. All right, so we got the catio painted. We've got the screens on. We got all of our little batten boards holding on our screens. So they're all custom cut and fit. And uh, it's almost done. So today what we're going to be trying to do is get our screen doors up. As you can see, I've got two of them right in a row with each other. i got this one here and then the one further back. But let's go take a look on the inside. See what it looks like. Got our nice parquet flooring. Again, everything's painted white. Got it all prepped up on the ceiling. 
And so the only thing we really need to do is just enclose the rest of it with the screens. And today we're also going to be bringing in um, a bunch of mulch. The reason why we're bringing in the mulch is because we do not want to have the weeds coming back in. So some of the things that we did is we, we planted some of these uh, bushes back over here. And now we're going to come back in with mulch so we can stop the weeds from growing. Um, right back over here against this back wall, we're going to be doing some of these rose bushes that you see. But let me take you up front and show you where else we're putting this mulch. Putting mulch all in the front here too. Now that we've got this all cleared out, leveled off, and our plants planted.